ikak na hundino alakak ne bo amra bo na ya na amra kam kala an kamani mani lidik ba what's the situation manuk maraka naja ki na wabam yak marana kam ino mendu naja na ya an kam mendik maraka this doesn't exactly sound legit la to ram anka mani ni kan Sorry about that, Cipher Nine. Welcome to the Eastern Galactic Front. This whole star system is a crisis point. Republic and Empire are testing one another's strength. Meanwhile, the terrorists lurk in the middle. It's a perfect place to operate, isn't it? Exactly right. The Eagles' men are using the war as a cover for local activities. Balmora is their training ground. Cell members recruit, instruct, and arm new terrorists here. Fresh soldiers destined for other points in the network. It's a vital part of the system. So where do I sign up to join? That I can't tell you, but you have the right idea. To dismantle the terror cell there, you'll need local support. I'm alerting one of our officials to your presence. Lacan Ronald is the station chief in Sobrick, the Imperial settlement where you landed. He runs intelligence operations on Balmora and can brief you more thoroughly. What's your assessment of the man? He's worked for us for decades. I've never met him, but I expect he's loyal. Ronald runs his affairs out of the back of an arms dealership. He'll be waiting for you when you arrive. Move quickly on this one, Cipher 9, and watch what you say. If things go bad, you'll have half a planet gunning for you. Well, what have we here? Let me take a look at you. Splendid! No one ever suspects an alien. I'm glad Keeper finally sent someone. Pity it took a disaster to get headquarters attention. You sound like you're familiar with the director. Oh, Keeper and I go back. I knew him before, well before he was Keeper. Wouldn't trust him if my life depended on it, though. Ha! <laughs> I kid, of course. Keeper's a good sort. But here, I'm being a poor host. Have a drink. Settle in after your trip. This shop doesn't look like much, but it's secure. Do you always imbibe on the job? And I suppose you've never sat in a cantina with a glass of Luranian brandy hoping your cover hasn't been blown. Ours is a dangerous profession, Agent. We all find ways to take the edge off. But on to business. These terrorists you're after, they've been a thorn in my side for a long while. They're worse than the Republic in some ways. So they're not working with the Republic? This terror cell is homegrown, made up of Balmorans unhappy with the Empire's rule. I suspect the Republic tacitly supports the terrorists, with their common enemy. So we do our best to cope with the bombings and sabotage. What's your response been so far? The Governor makes an example of a few dozen Balmorans after each attack, but it doesn't have much of an effect. Meanwhile, I've been studying the terror cell's structure, and there's good news. If we can take out the local leader, the cell should fall apart. What do we know about this person? The terrorists call the man in charge Grey Star. He runs the cell, gives the orders, and knows all the secrets. They claim Grey Star used to work with the Eagle, but who can be sure? Only the high-ranking cell members know Grey Star's identity. It's a complication, but there's opportunity there. I have a mole inside the terrorist cell already. He's a good lad. No cipher, though. He can bring you in. You'd have the opportunity to impress the terrorists, win their trust and gain access to their leader. Precisely. Grey Star will be ours. Sanju Pine, my operative, can introduce you to the terrorist recruiters at the Troida military workshop outside the safe zone. But be careful how you present yourself. If the terrorists suspect you're Imperial, you'll lose Grey Star. And your lives. Don't waste my time, Sanju. You're lucky to even be here. I got you those scramblers, didn't I? Come on, Kimish, you owe me. Maybe not big time, but you owe me. When's the last time you did an operation for us? What? Come on, we've been over this. Star didn't send out a call for cowards, and neither did the Eagle. Do you think... Hey, someone finally made it. It's great to meet you in person. This is the group I was telling you about. I think you'll get along with them real well. Better than I do, hopefully. I've been looking forward to meeting your friends. Kemish, this is the guy who got in touch with me after the Eagle's broadcast. Said he wanted to join us. Uh-huh. Sandu says you fought the Imperials at Druckenwell. Says the Empire has a bounty on your head. I didn't know you were at Druckenwell. We should talk. Is all that real? You some ace killer looking to get the Empire off Balmora? You think I don't live up to my reputation? 
Maybe I do. Can you blame me? My name's Kemish. These people here, they follow Greystar, our founder. They've been spat on, starved, and punished by the Empire. Now you, you're not from Balmora. You haven't been through what they've been through. Makes me wonder how far I can trust you. You don't have to trust me. Let me prove myself. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe you can impress Greystar. There's an abandoned factory not far from here. Used to make droids. But its defenses went haywire when the Empire took over. Place is swarming with rogue security units. It's also full of expensive equipment. Get inside, and there's something I want. Name it, and it's yours. The Okara Droid Factory produced shielded power cores for stealth droids. I want a case for my people. My people can convert the cores into explosives, plant them around an enemy base, and thanks to the stealth shielding, no one will know until it's too late. As soon as you say the word, I can be on my way. Let's be up front. This is a test. So if you fail, don't bother coming back. We'll just kill you. Good luck. And be careful. The factory's a nasty place. Thank the stars I reached you. Sorry about earlier. With Kemish there, I couldn't say it then. Station Chief Reynolds told me you were from Imperial Intelligence, so I set things up as fast as I could. Anyway, uh, Sanju Pai. Guess you know that. I'm Cypher 9. Rinald said good things about you. I'm trying not to mess up anyway. So, Kimish verified your background. Intelligence did its job, you're fine there. I'm doing my best to find out anything about the cell leader, Greystar. Maybe you can learn more when Kimish trusts you. I need you safe. Finding out about Greystar is my mission, not yours. I appreciate that, but I've been inside the cell for a year now, and they haven't gotten suspicious yet. There's one other thing. Those power cores you're after? You know what Kemish plans to do with them, right? She's gonna attack Sobrik. She'll have some of the new recruits plant the bombs and run, hit the town and the Imperial base. That's very nearly sickening. I know a way to disable the power core so Kimish won't suspect you. There's a machine in the factory that can do it. Run the sealed case through the machine, and the cores will fry. Kemish will see you didn't unlock it. She'll assume the cores went bad over the years. It's a risk. But we could save a lot of people. I'm in. Great. I'll send you the machine's coordinates. We can stop a lot of bloodshed. I'll see you when you get back to Detroit, okay? Sanju out. Kinda cute, isn't he? Kinda stupid, too. If he had money, he'd be perfect. Don't let me stand in your way. I never will. Anyway, let's find that machine. Or maybe not. Back already? Your friend's quick, Sanju. Told you he was good. You tell me a lot of things, but I asked for the stealth droid power cores. If you don't have them, you're wasting my time. Spare me the attitude. I want to work with you. Here. Huh. Looks like you actually made it to the factory. It'll take a minute to get this case open. Sanju, go fetch Pyther and a droid. I think we've got it, Kemish. Crack the case open and let's see if our new friend did the job right. Looks like everything's here. Except... What's this? The readouts say the power cores are fried. What did you do? That case was sitting there for a long time. Looks like the power core is decayed. It is suspicious. But power cores are pretty fragile. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Bad luck can happen to anyone. Once. You said yourself that you need good people. Let me try again. Fine. I'll give you one more shot, but you better make this work. You've seen the caves in this valley? Dark and cramped, but they make a nice hiding place. Scanners bounce right off them. Useful. For all sorts of things. Seems like a good discovery. Greystar set up a training outpost in the caves a while back. Then the Empire started dropping gas bombs on the Republic. The outpost was poisoned. Toxin got into the soil. Turned good kids into drooling psychos and the caves were overrun by our own people. There's gotta be a way to flush the toxin out of your people. Restore their sanity. Early on, maybe there was. It's way too late now. We're willing to cut our losses, but there's still data on the outpost computers. I want it transmitted out and the systems destroyed. Sanju, get to high ground outside of town. You can pick up the signal with the booster box. Is all that clear? The toxin victims will be after you, but get that data wiped or we're finished. 
What's so important about the computers? That's none of your business. You just do your job. I'm receiving your transmission. Give me a second to fine-tune the frequency and I'll start transferring the data. There. It's all coming in now. I guess you made it to the outpost, okay? You wouldn't believe what it took to get here. Probably not. Tell me over a drink sometime. All this data Kimmich wanted us to retrieve. I think some of it's from Greystar. Orders, communiques, all sorts of stuff. Last, there's a list of collaborators. Balmorans who have been working with the Empire since the occupation. Kimmich hates collaborators. What do you think her plans are for the list? Kimmich probably wants to make the list public. If the collaborators are outed, a lot of Balmorans will want them dead. Some of these guys are officials, factory bosses, the works. If they start getting killed, the governor's gonna punish everyone. Punish them how, exactly? After a big terrorist hit, the governor rounds up a bunch of civilians. Most of them disappear forever. Look, I can send the list on to the Imperial authorities. They can set up protection for the collaborators in case Kemish goes public. I know Kemish might get suspicious after what happened with the power cores, but what else can we do? Get the message out to secure the collaborators. No one else has to die. All right, I'll do my part. We'll hope Kemish doesn't catch on. I need to sign off and get back to Troida. You should do the same. Send you out. You two are so good together. Sanji wants to save lives, you want to save lives. It's cute. Of course this won't end well. Maybe I should have my fun with him while I have a chance. The two of you can go and have a ball. Yeah. On the other hand, if he's going down, I don't really want to go down with him. Sanju will never know what he's missed. Let's get going, huh? You made it to the outpost okay? Good. Sanju was just showing me the data you sent back. In fact, you did the job pretty well. There's just one little problem. Tell me and we'll solve it together. Fine. Listen up. I had a list of collaborators on the outpost computer. Sanju downloaded the list and gave it to me. All good so far. But now the Imperials are posting extra security around my targets. Looks like there's a leak inside my organization. Any ideas? I've been busy with your missions. Why are you asking me? You're new here. I thought fresh eyes might be a help. Maybe not. Greystar will know how to handle this. For now, I need your skills for a special job. I don't have anyone else who can do it. Sounds like you're starting to rely on me. If that's what it sounds like, then that's what it sounds like. You know all about the way the Empire and the Republic have been using our planet as a battleground. Pretty obvious stuff. Normally, the Republic doesn't bother us, they've got other worries. But I need someone to get inside the main Republic base. It won't be simple, but you've come to the right person. Good attitude. I need you to make a drop to one of our friends in the Republic ranks. Get past the guards, get inside and make the delivery. That's it. What delivery? Who am I looking for? You want to work with us, you need to get used to not knowing every little detail. She's right. It's just part of the setup. Don't get offended. Here's the package and the coordinates of your target. He'll know what to do once you make the delivery. We're clearing out this safe house, so I'll contact you once we've settled somewhere else. And be careful at the base. They find you, they kill you. Believe me, I can handle a few soldiers. See you in a while. If you make it back alive, I can promise we'll be working together a lot. We'll talk soon. Watch yourself. Hey, I don't have long, but please tell me you didn't deliver the package to the Republic base yet. What's going on, Sanju? That package you're carrying is for Greystar, the terror cell leader. Greystar's the man inside the Republic base. Kemish wants to extract him, and you've been sent to help. How did you find that out? That information you got from the training camp? Turned out to be real handy. As best I can tell, Greystar has been secretly managing and supplying the terror cell while pretending to be a loyal Republic officer. It was the perfect cover. Up until the Republic started to suspect. Now Greystar needs to escape before he's caught. Why does the Republic care? The terrorists aren't going to let the Republic take Balmora back. The Empire's their main enemy, but they don't think the Republic's much better. Your package contains instructions and maps leading to a safe house. But... We could change those instructions, send Greystar into a trap. Once we have Greystar, we could make him give up his security protocols. 
we could send out orders to the cell using his name. In that case, the Empire would have the whole cell as a puppet. That's the idea. I know how Kimish and her people think. If we capture Greystar and learn what he knows, I can forge convincing orders. Chief Reynolds has been looking for a way to turn the terrorists against the Republic for ages. We can make it work. You're trickier than I thought, Sanji. I'm sending you rendezvous coordinates. If you want to do this thing, tell Greystar to meet me there. I'll arrange the rest. If you don't send him my way, well, I guess you'll have to kill him. I don't think it'll come to killing Greystar. Good luck, then. I don't know if I'll see you again. Depending on what happens with Greystar, I may have to go into hiding for a while. But it's been an honor working with you. Sanju, out. How did you know I was coming? Can't you at least tell me what you're doing here? There's been a change of plans. You're going to rendezvous with one of our people at these coordinates. When you get to the rendezvous, give them my regards. I expect a full report as soon as possible, Station Chief. Of course, of course, of course. As soon as things have calmed down, Ha! What have we here? If it isn't the Cypher himself, come triumphantly to our doorstep. I was just telling our Keeper about you. Am I interrupting a meeting? No, we were finishing up. Reynold, summarize the situation for Cypher 9. You gave us quite a prize, Cypher. The Terra Cell under our control. Greystar captured and replaced by Sanju Pine, of all people. I never dreamed we'd see such success, but Sanju has already begun sending orders, and the terrorists now unwittingly serve us. Is Sanju managing all right? There's a lot of pressure on him. Oh, the boy's fine, just fine. A bit overwhelmed, maintaining two identities at once, but we'll guide him through it. For the time being, Sanju will use the Grey Star persona to gather information and turn the terrorists against the Republic. As time goes on, we may find other uses for the terrorists. But that's another discussion. The Balmoran cell is no longer a threat. The other cells in the Eagle's network will no longer receive fresh recruits and supplies from this world. Any news on our primary target? Progress is being made, but now is not the time for that discussion. Station Chief Reynolds will take matters from here. He'll run cleanup and forward any discoveries to headquarters. When you return to your ship, contact Watcher 2. She will brief you on all new developments and transfer credits to your discretionary accounts. I'll be on my way shortly. Good work once again, Cypher 9. Keep her out. That man hides it well, but the strain's getting to him. Probably worried the Dark Council will skin him alive. I'd be worried too, if I were Keeper. Make no mistake, I don't hold him responsible for what happened, but Darth Jadis was assassinated on his watch. Ah, oh, but now's no time to discuss politics. You deserve a moment of celebration, and I have work to do. I'll let you get to it, then. Safe journey, young Cypher. Not bad, Agent. Not bad at all. You and me, we're going places. Transmission established. This is Watcher 2. I'm glad you checked in, Cypher. Chatter has increased among the surviving cells. 
and it seems the Eagle is planning another attack. What kind of attack? I'm not sure. The Eagle only needed one cell to bomb the Dominator and assassinate Darth Jadis. For what's coming, he's using the entire Terra network. But the messages we've intercepted are frustratingly vague. Just cryptic references to devices called eradicators. If anyone can get to the truth of it, you can. I'm plugging myself into the monitors while I sleep, hoping my subconscious will sort it out. No luck so far. Not much to be done at the moment. You need to focus on taking the Terra network apart. As you eliminate the larger cells, we can identify more terrorist activity centers. Eliminate enough, and the network will lose cohesion. Then I'll proceed to the next cell. I'll do everything I can from here. It's been four days since I stepped outside the Citadel. But I'm in no hurry. I'll be in touch. Watch her two out.